Hey, what's good, family? How y'all doing? Hope y'all doing well. I just ate the most gangsterlicious bread I've ever had in my life. Um, it was sold at the, um, uh, the the special needs school I just finished. By the way, if you're wondering why for am I carrying an umbrella, yet it ain't raining, uh, answer that question. That sun is bright. I'm not digging it and for years I used to see you know or you, you see women especially like especially older women here will go out and uh, you know have the little parasols with them little umbrellas with them to try and keep the Sun out because you know they don't I used to think it's like oh they don't want to be dark skinned but I figured out oh wait no skin cancer that's the thing people don't want so yeah there's that um but anyway that's some gangster delicious bread uh, yeah, I was thinking about something, you know, uh, a little bit while them little adorable icons of Christ were leaving, the little adorable little cheerings. I was thinking of two things. The first thing <clears throat> is, if you want instant sainthood, like if you want a guarantee, not not a literal guarantee, don't take my word for this, I'm kind of being hyperbolic, so don't, don't get all like, you know, don't take me serious, man, don't listen to me, I'm stupid. But, um, if you want instant sainthood, uh, work at a school with children with special needs do that for a prolonged period of time instant sainthood again please don't take my word for this i'm not like a saint or a theologian or a smart person so really honestly speaking you probably shouldn't be watching this video to begin with you know there's a lot of smarter people out in the world but whatever anyway because like you know when the kids leave and you're sitting there shake, saying bye to them shaking their hands yeah, I mean, uh, sorry about the wind, you know, shaking their hands, uh, you know, waving bye to them, and you look at, look directly in their eyes, it's adorable. Oh, it's beyond pretty. It's, it's an amazing thing, man. Like, you look in their eyes, man, and you see just, you know, beauty. You know, indescribable beauty and uh, oneness. You know what I mean? And tell me how... Tell me how I'm leaving, right? I'm leaving, going downstairs to say bye to the children. And then, like, going down. All right, my umbrella gonna break. I don't want my umbrella to break. Um, and tell me how, tell me how, sorry, I had to close my umbrella. Tell me how, going down the street, I smell, or going down the stairs, I smell incense, like, from church, right? Like, the exact same fragrance, man. It's crazy. But anyway, it's, like, you gotta do it, man. You gotta do it. It's fantastic. Um, another thing I was thinking about, slightly different, was how racism is possibly the funniest and most tragic idea that we humans have ever came up with. I mean, it's hilariously tragic. Yeah, I mean, like, what I mean by that is, think about it. It's humans. We're all one, you know, if you, if you take especially the, the Christian view of it, we're all of one essence, you know, the human essence, you know, crafted in the uh, image of God. Yeah, I mean, uh, we are, you know, in a sense, the greatest of, of art pieces, right? And labors of love, and we're all the same. We are all one. There's one human essence. Yet, we have decided to come up with this idea that separates us when something as odd as varying levels of melanin and slight, ever so slight facial uh, differences in, in hair and stuff, right? It's, 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 it's funny because of how stupid it is and it's sad because of how many lives have been ruined and lost because of such a stupid idea anyway I'm, I'm rambling too long and this wind's getting stronger and stronger I love y'all oh no again look at this beautifulness so I love y'all y'all take care and have a good one